Hey everyone, it's More Crafts back for another video. Hi everybody! And mom. <laughs> I, add, I just kind of put my two cents in. Adding her two cents in. So we just got back from the store and I have a little yarn haul. I have no idea how many skeins I got. I wouldn't call it little. Um, so we're gonna count that. One, two, three, four, five. 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, like 15, I think. These are just some, like, basic colors that I needed. Um, <clears throat> so, I got them at Walmart. They're Red Heart and Mainstays. And I can't wait because the 17th I'm going to Joanne's and getting more yarn. And I'm really excited because if I don't... Every, if everything goes good. Yeah, if everything goes good, I'm going to go to Joanne's and get more yarn. Um, so, pray that everything goes right. Um, the yarn I got today is going to stay here at the apartment, the apartment where I am most of the time. <clears throat> but, when I go to Joanne's on the 17th, I'm getting yarn for here and I'm getting yarn for down at Graham's. Um, I'm getting two of every color other than slime and spring green. I'm getting multiple of those because I have a lot of projects in mind that need those colors. So those are the only two colors that I'm going to get like four of each. So I'm excited. So, I got, then we went to the Dollar Tree. No offense, kid, but you're always excited to go to, to get yarn. Yeah, but how, I don't buy it like I used to. Well, seems like every freaking day we was there. Seems like every day, when, like a couple years ago, I was at Joanne's like every couple days. Um, but now I just do like big hauls, um, instead of a bunch of little ones. And then next month, I'm hoping to go to Michael's to see what their yarn selection is. Because I've heard a lot of people say that their Michael's yarn selection has gone down a lot. Um, so I just want to go and see how my Michael's is. Um, so like I said, we went to the Dollar Tree after we went to Walmart. And I got some fabric there, and I only got... And I was able to go in! And Mom was able to go in because we got a wheelchair today, and she fits in it really nice. So I was able to push her around, and she was able to go in for the first time in several years. So the first one I got is this little heart print. They only had one of these. So I don't know what I'm going to make with this one. I might make a... I'm going to probably make a project bag just to use it up, but I don't know. They only had one, so Time will tell. So I don't know what I'm going to do with it, but I, they, like I said, they only had one of those, and then I got this one here, and it reminds me so much of cotton candy with the pinks and the blues, so I got that one. Then I got this butterfly and ladybug. I got two of these. Where's the ladybugs? The little red dots. Oh, that's what they are. Okay. And then this one I got because I thought it was really pretty. So, gonna make pro big project bags out of the ones that I have two of. And then I don't know what I'll make with that little one. So... Um, so now let's get into the yarn. So, your prized possession. Like I said, I only got a handful of colors just because they're like what I really needed. Um, so, so I got this pink. It is perfect pink. Red Heart yarn, Super Saver. Um, 7 ounces, 198 grams, 364 yards. 333 meters. So I got this one. 
I got bright yellow because all of the yellows that I have are very muted. Like they're not, they're yellow, but they're very um, they're soft. They're very pale. So I got this bright yellow. And surprisingly, this actually looks yellow. Um, I know a couple years ago, they came out with bright yellow and there was a green tinge to it. And it made it kind of look dirty. But this one is actually a really nice bright yellow. I got this one because there's at least three projects that I know need bright yellow. That I'm planning on making to sell. So, I got that one. Um, I got this shade of, this is buff, because I needed some skin tones and some browns, so I got buff. And then I also got Mainstays yarn, and it's just brown. And the 397 yards, 363 meters, 7 ounces, 198.4 grams. It's a medium worsted. Five and a half knitting needle, five and a half crochet hook, worsted weight yarn, 100% acrylic, machine wash, tumble dry. The red heart is a worsted weight yarn, five and a half crochet hook, five millimeter knitting needle, 100% acrylic, machine wash and dry. Which this is all I use. I all I don't use wool. I don't use um, blends. I use acrylic because I do a lot of donating and I need it to be able to wash and dry very easily because when I make something I don't know where it's going until at the end of the year when I do my donations and I don't know where it's going whenever I sell something either so acrylic and cotton are the only yarns I use. Then I got this really pretty color. It's called Mulberry. Mulberry. Yeah, it's really pretty. It is pretty. So I got that one. And I got black. And I got white. Um, I probably didn't need black and white, but I got them because I can always use them. And I got minty. Really like this color. And then I got this gold color here, which is saffron. Now, one of the character, or one of the things that I'm planning on making, um, this might be a better color for it. It's, um, it has something to do with Winnie the Pooh. So, I'm thinking this color might be better for it than the, uh, bright yellow. So I'm not sure. I'll have to figure that out. And then I got this green. This is just mainstays green. I got this light pink. This one is baby pink. I got two different oranges. I got this one and whole way man is that blowing out. This is just orange. It's bright. And then I got pumpkin. They did not have carrot. I was hoping they would have had carrot. Um, I needed some oranges because I have like one shade of orange. And when I go to Joann's, I'm hoping to get a rusty orange color. I'm pretty sure they have a rusty orange color. I'm not sure what it's called, but I'm pretty sure they do have it. But I got this orange. And then I got Aaron, because I also needed some, a different shade of brown, or tan, cream, whatever. And then I got Frosty Green. So, now I have to decide if I'm going to finish what I was working on before we left the house at 8.30 this morning. Actually, it was eight. It, it was about 9 o'clock when we left this morning. Um, so now I don't know if I want to roll cakes. Mom's probably going to say roll yes, cakes. Yes, roll cakes. Because she loves when I roll cakes. I don't know why. That is, like, that is like watching you. But she likes when I roll cakes. And then that will be... Then I will be able to... Um, 
put them away. So I'm going to have to clean my stand off. Because I have like a whole bunch of, I'm going to show you. I have a whole bunch of body parts that I'm going to need. You know, I'm really, I'm not needing them. They hear us talking about body parts and shit. Yeah, I'm really glad my neighbor can't hear us very well. our body parts in bags. Because, yeah, like mom said, I put my body, like, when I make hammer groomies, I do all, all the fiddly bits first. Like the arms, legs, ears, nose, tail, all of that. And they go in a sandwich bag until I'm ready to then I, when I finish everything then that's when I sew everything together so I was working on a baby um, grim grinning goat by grim grinning goats um, and I'm working on a baby one Say that ten times fast. so I have to put all of my stuff away like my easel that I use for my patterns I got this at Michael's for like five bucks. You got that thing a long time ago. I got this thing a long time ago. I've had to glue it several times, but now I super glued it and now it ain't going anywhere. Because I was tired of it fall literally falling apart. Um, so that's all my, that's my little yarn haul for now. And then I will have another one on the 17th and another one in July. And I'm excited. July? Going to Michael's? Oh. Well, Michael's is, like I said, is a toss up because I don't know what their yarn selection looks like. So that's what I'm going there to see. I couldn't tell you the last time. And I, I couldn't tell, we couldn't tell you the last time I went into Michael's. And now that mom has a wheelchair, I don't know if she's going to go in with me. Yeah. Um, so, I'm going to, we're going to, she's going to get a basket, and, um, hopefully I get yarn. If not, then I'll just go, we we'll just go to Walmart. And I'll get yarn there. Unless Joanne's is having a sale, which, um, they just had their big twist um, value yarn on sale. It ended on the second, and I'm very which was yesterday. Which was yesterday. I'm very upset about that. That I missed it. So I hope they have it again on sale on um, the seventeenth. So fingers crossed that they have it on sale on the seventeenth, and I can get some because. I'm really excited about it. I haven't been able to go into Joanne's for a long time. And my birthday is in 10 days and I will be 33. I'm excited about that too. You old fart? Like you want to talk. Almost 50. I'm not almost 50. You will be 50 in October. No, I will not. She will be. She'll be 50 in October. No. -uh. October 5th, exactly. So, can you prove it? Yeah, give me your freaking driver's license and your birth certificate. Did I mess you up? No. I guess I'm doing what I had to do. <laughs> okay, guys, I am gonna let you guys go. I'm gonna start winding this yarn. It is Yay. 1 16 in the afternoon. We literally just got home at like 12. 35, 12, lunch. 40. And we ate lunch. And now we're just chillaxing because we've been on the go since 9 o'clock this morning. No, it was before that. We left here at what? We left here at 8.45. Yeah. We went over, got put, take, took the garbage, and then we went to the post office. And we didn't get nothing. Well, we got some mail, but it was mostly bills and junk. So. Yeah, mostly bills. So yeah, I'm going to let you guys go. Hope you guys have a great rest of your day, and I'll talk to you guys again later. Bye, everybody. Bye.